The Mortar is the fifth card evolution coming to Clash Royale in July 2023. This video will answer the question, why is the Mortar the fifth evolution, but not everyone's favorite card, for example. By the time I am making this video, the Evolved Mortar isn't even out yet, but I found a lot of information anyway. And you won't want to miss the ending. Let's start with what the Evolved Mortar even looks like. Well, it is literally the exact same as the Barbarian Launcher, but with a Goblin instead of a Barbarian. The Goblin is the same one from the Goblin Barrel. One of them will do tons of damage alone, especially at level 15. And the final thing, it will take two cycles to deploy because it is a common card. This is important. There is a new game mode called Dark Elixir coming to Clash Royale for only six days. This special game mode is the reason why the Mortar is getting an evolution. Let me explain. Dark Elixir is a game mode where it is a normal battle, but there will be random Dark Elixir circles on the map. The circles will super rage any card, but make any damage that hits the card double. So the card will be a lot stronger, but takes two times any damage when in the circle. So what does this have to do with the Mortar? Well, every player knows that the Mortar is a win condition. It is always played by protecting it with other troops while it destroys the princess towers with pile-up damage. That's what makes it so good in this game mode. In the Dark Elixir circles, the Mortar will be protected, so in most cases, it will not take double damage. And it is a lot stronger because the Super Rage, making any opponent uninstall the game instantly. Let me know in the comments what you think about the Mortar getting an evolution. And do you agree with this video? Subscribe, and like if you enjoyed and want more videos like this, clash on!